really excited about um, some of the work being done around the social health information exchange uh, because of the work that needs to happen for our patients, not only in the clinic setting, uh, but also in our community and how we can better share data. Related to um, the health-related social needs and the social determinants of health, uh, we're starting to implement uh, screening tools and collaborations with community-based organizations so that we can provide the supports for the needs that our patients have. We've uh, screened over 40,000 patients. Of those 40,000 patients, we have uh, the ones that say they have some needs. Uh, 6,000 of them have food needs, for example. So um, the food partnerships are the easiest example. We're partnering um, with um, some community-based organizations to provide food to a couple of our clinics, but we're also partnering with, for example, Food Bank of the Rockies to do a, a food delivery program to the people's houses that have food insecurity, but also, for example, hypertension, cardiovascular disease, diabetes, and prediabetes.